Hey there, Norman here from WoCode and Airtable has changed its authentication methods for adding securities and they now use personal tokens instead of API keys. To create an Airtable collection using a personal token, first we'll select Airtable as usual and then we'll be taken to this connect with Airtable screen. From here, we can simply click this Airtable account page button and this will take us to this screen right here, which as you can see, it is mentioning that the API keys will be deprecated by the end of January, 2024. We can simply click go to developer hub. And then from this screen, we can simply click create token. And from here, we can proceed to create our token. Now in the future, if you need to access this and that button is not available. Alternatively, you can access and create tokens by making sure you're logged into Airtable and going directly to airtable.com forward slash create forward slash tokens. So now that we're on the personal access token page, we can click the blue create token button. From here, we have a number of options. We'll start from the top. We want to give this a name. You can name this whatever you'd like. For this example, I will name this tutorial token. Following that, we'll have our scopes option, which is just basically means we'll set the permissions of the token. We can click add a scope and we'll want to make sure that we select read and write. So data.records read, data.records write. Below that, we have our access permissions. This is where you can set which Airtable bases this token can access. You can pick a specific base, however, for the sake of simplicity and unless otherwise specifically needed, we can select the all current and future bases for this workspaces option. And now we can click create token. Your token will be created and shown in the pop up and we can copy that token and head back into the builder and paste that right into the access token field. Just like that, you're good to go, and you've now added your access token to your Airtable collection.